fam, it's your girl Gladys and welcome to Is That Your Hair? I create hair, fashion, and lifestyle content that will encourage you to be your very best self. So if you're with that, you're in the right place. Today we're doing another Amazon clothing haul. This time we're focusing on items for Valentine's Day. Super excited because I picked up a lot of cute stuff, y'all, a lot. So I think you're really going to enjoy this. I actually gave a sneak peek to some of you when I went live on Amazon. Yes, y'all, you can go live on Amazon. Quite a few of us content creators are doing that now and it's a lot of fun. So I definitely recommend you follow my Amazon storefront because when you do, you can be notified about when I go live and you can get more sneak peeks of things that I purchased, things that I recommend. So in this haul, I'm going to showcase a few casual items, some accessories, lots of dresses, and I think I'm going to sneak in some lingerie. <laughs> I'm also going to do another Amazon haul strictly for lingerie, so look out for that as well. Now, if you see anything that you like, everything is listed in the description box. Very detailed. I try to make it easy for y'all to shop if you choose to shop through my links. When y'all do that, do know that you are directly supporting is that your hair, and that means the world to your girl, okay? Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Now, as far as my measurements, I'm a 38D, 34 waist, 44 hip, I'm 5'3". I wear like a size medium, large in tops, large, extra large in bottoms, size 10, 12. Yeah, that's it. So let's start with some accessories, okay? I have some cute stuff for Valentine's Day, y'all. I'm so excited. We're gonna start with these earrings. Found these super cute heart-shaped earrings on Amazon. Oh my God, they're adorable. It's like a beaded texture in the front and then felt in the back. And I actually like the fact that it's felt in the back because that, that it feels really comfortable on the ear. <laughs> they also have this pair available in pink. Last time I checked the pink was sold out. I'll still link them though in case you want to get pink. I'm sorry that I'm getting this video out a little bit late y'all, but hopefully you have Amazon Prime because then you'll be able to get some of these items within one to two days. So, cross my fingers. Also, I want you to know that I do have some items that do work for plus size women. And if you are looking for more inspiration, check out my description box. I always have a section just for those who are plus size so y'all can look through and find things that you like. Okay, the next item, I'm so excited about this. Look at this purse. I don't even know if this video is doing it justice, but it's absolutely adorable. I love this acrylic purse. What I love most about it is just the style. It's so unique. It looks like confetti that's just been mashed together into a rectangle. I can definitely tell it's acrylic because it smells like it. <laughs> But that's okay. Overall, I really like it and I'm definitely wearing this on V-Day, so cannot wait. By the way, y'all, this haul is not just for Valentine's Day. I also celebrate Valentine's Day, which I am doing this year, and that's when you celebrate with your close friends the day before V-Day. So I encourage y'all to try that this year if you haven't, because it's nice to take some time out to show love to your special friends. Like, why not? Okay, this next purse I found, <laughs> it's literally a purse in the shape of a rotary phone. <laughs> can you believe that? It comes with some straps here. I mean, as you can see, I haven't worn it out yet, but it has straps, it hooks up to the purse. And actually what's really cool about this is that this, ooh, ow. This phone is supposed to hook up to your cell phone. This isn't gonna hook up to my iPhone, but C has an end piece that will make this compatible with my iPhone. I'll actually find it on Amazon in case you're interested in buying this purse and you have an iPhone too. I just think this is such a statement piece. I didn't think I'd be into this, but when I saw it on someone else's haul, I had to grab it. It's also very spacious on the inside. You could fit a lot of stuff inside of here, so. Yeah, this is cute. The next bag I purchased is this black bag. Now the thing is, even though the reviews definitely said it was bigger than expected, I don't know why I still thought it was gonna be smaller. And it, it's bigger than I thought. Like if you measure it up to here, it like takes up almost my entire torso here. I bought this bag because it, to me it has a very unique design with this keyhole in the center. It has like this button closure on the inside and it has a ton of space in here. I wouldn't wear this particularly out for Valentine's Day, but I think this is a nice purse to wear if you're looking cute while running errands or even going out to dinner with friends. I also like the embossment here. It's supposed to give like crocodile pattern. This doesn't feel like the highest quality to me, but it still gives you a cute look. So if you're interested, the links are there. Check out this purse. Now, if you need a good hat, Amazon has it for you at a very affordable price point, under $20. I have it in red, black, and brown, and it just looks good. I think we already know, when you wear a hat, you automatically elevate your look. Here's a clip of me from my last haul that I just put out, wearing this hat with that wrap dress and the cream boots. Honey, 
Tell me it's not a look. <laughs> I absolutely loved how I styled this. Now, if you have trouble fitting hats over your wigs like I do, you can use a hat stretcher. I haven't used one for this yet. When I put it on over my wig, I just kind of like literally stretched it with my hands. But getting a hat stretcher will definitely increase the width of these hats. So I will link one down below for y'all. All right, y'all, let's get into the clothing items that I have. And we're going to start with this robe. I just purchased this last week and I swear this robe is absolutely gorgeous. The way that the sleeves flare out with the feathers, I think it looks so regal. <laughs> I feel like a queen in this robe. I'm 5'3 and I think the length falls nicely on me. However, if you're taller like 5'7, 5'8, 5'9, you know, it's gonna fall shorter on you. This robe is a one size fits all type of robe. I'm pretty sure the direct link says that at the hip, the widest is 53 inches. So check those links and also read reviews to make sure you know what you're getting into. I mean, I'm wearing this right now and I don't wanna take it off. <laughs> Originally, I was gonna come on in a dress, but then I was like, no, I'm just gonna keep this robe on. They're gonna get all this robe. Like, do you see me? I, uh, I just love this, y'all. This is beyond Valentine's Day. You should feel how I feel in this robe every day of the week. Okay, the next item I have here is a three-piece set. This is like a workout jogging set. It's this baby pink color, which I think would be really nice for V-Day. Let's say you wake up, you know, that morning, you're trying to go for a brisk walk, a little run, throw on this three-piece set. To me, the main pro is the color and the fit. I think the size large fits me wonderfully. However, the con is that it's thin. Like, do you see those bottoms? It's like see-through. Up and down my thighs, through my butt all see-through you can see the pockets are thicker but why don't they use the same material throughout i'm kind of torn i want to keep it because i don't have anything like it i've been looking for a set like this but uh, at the same time i don't like the thin material however because spring is coming this set i think will be perfect for spring just know you can't be wearing all types of colorful underwear underneath this you gotta wear some type of seamless underwear a thong anything like that Okay, so this next outfit is something really casual, cute, you know, something daytime appropriate. I finally got a pair of bootcut, slightly flared jeans, recommended to me by another YouTuber, and I absolutely love them. I'm wearing an extra large. It's definitely roomy in the crotch area, which probably means I should have gotten a large, but I'm still fine with it because when I'm eating, I like a little room around my stomach, you know what I'm saying? But now this pink top, honey, this top is gorgeous as y'all can probably tell by my instagram i've been wearing a lot of pink fuchsias lately it's become like my new favorite color to wear and with this outfit it's no different one thing i love about this top is that it's super stretchy y'all super stretchy in the shoulders and there's stretch here in the back area i have this in a size medium which fits me perfectly i'm definitely gonna get this in more colors this is a great item to transition into the spring absolutely a must-have top and i like the way it crisscrosses in the back i feel like this is the type of top that any of us could be comfortable wearing even though it's a crop top I feel like you can adjust it to make it looser around the stomach area or tighter depending on what you prefer I love this fit especially paired with the little cute telephone purse <laughs> by the way are you guys interested in me doing a jeans haul with items from Amazon I've been thinking about it I'm on the hunt currently for the perfect pair of distressed denim jeans from Amazon and I think it'd be cool to bring that to y'all so let me know in the comments if that's what y'all want to see but so far this is this is a winner for me i think the next time i order it though i'll just get a large to see if i like that fit a little bit better now you'll also see me wearing this skirt here from shein i have it in a size large i think i want to try the plus size version with the large plus because even though this fits me there's no stretch at the waist whatsoever and i just feel like it stays up at my highest point of my waist which is fine if that's the look i'm going for like if i'm wearing a super short crop top but sometimes i want to wear my skirt a little bit lower like mid waist and i can't do that with this skirt so that's the only thing i have another brand in mind right now that sells this skirt in a similar style i'll link it down below for those who need a larger size i'm gonna try that next time and bring that to y'all when i do a spring haul but overall this is gorgeous like this green this olive green oh come through i love this it says it's 100% polyester. That, that's what it is. When items are 100% polyester, y'all, I always have to go up one size. So now that makes sense why it fits this way. Okay, cool. Before we go into our next items, I want to show you these shoes I purchased. Let me show y'all these. These right here, 
are from The Drop on Amazon. The Drop is a collection that normally collabs with different influencers on fashion items that they curate with the Amazon brand. You'll see here it says The Drop on the foot and on the back. I have been eyeing these shoes since last year and I finally got a pair. Some of you may be familiar with them because they're super popular and I see why. Because they give you a little bit of height but they're still comfortable because of the length of the shoe. You see that the slope is not that arched. These straps here, I was walking around a little bit in them and they feel pretty comfortable. This strap like right here does feel a bit firm. I have a core on my pinky toe, so I'm a little worried that this strap might bother my corn, but I just gotta walk around in them some more and give y'all a proper assessment. But overall, I'm loving these shoes and they come in a bunch of colors. If all goes well when I rock these, best believe I'll be buying another pair. If you don't have any corns like me, you should be good to go <laughs> without any question. <laughs> These feel so sturdy and I love this type of heel. Now the next pair of shoes that I bought, shout out to my boo thing, my little fashion bestie Liz too. She put me on to these. They're a little bit cloudy in the clear part because my foot was oily when I put my foot in them. But these are popping. Y'all see these? Look at this shoe. A gorgeous heel, y'all. I just love any type of clear heel. I'll never get tired of it. Compared to the shoe from the drop, right? You can see that this heel, the arch here is definitely higher. And I haven't worn heels in a while, y'all. Like heels like this, it's been a minute. I feel like I forgot how to walk in them. But when I tried them on yesterday, it wasn't so bad. I think I just need to walk around in them in the house to build up my confidence, to build up some strength in my ankles. You know what I mean? Let me know if you know what I mean in the comments. Because these are too cute not to rock. <laughs> But Liz was telling me that they're super comfortable. She was able to wear them out for hours and hours while out. So I have faith. This might be the Valentine's Day shoe. Haven't decided yet, but it's a very good contender. And this has great reviews on Amazon too. Check it out in the link. That's another thing, y'all. You have to check through these Amazon reviews. They are your best bet at getting what you want. <laughs> You'd be a fool not to read through the reviews. Now there are certain things, of course, when I say they're good, they're good. Like you can trust my judgment. But even for me, I look through reviews after reviews, you know, to make sure I like something. Below key, when Liz says she likes something, I just like buy it. <laughs> All right, y'all, the next item we have here is this romper. How cute is this romper you know i used to be kind of anti-romper for a while because i felt like it made my shape look weird but i think the fact that this flares out it makes me look even more shapely than i think i am you know i like it i like it a lot i'm wearing a size large and the large fits me perfectly trust me i know because i ordered an extra large at first i don't know why i just i get nervous when things aren't stretchy extra large was really roomy so doing a large was perfect look at these cute roses and i'm not even like a floral type of girl but low key i think i'm about to get floral all up through my wardrobe in the spring and summer months i, I think i'm feeling it now this is not a super stretchy item y'all the most stretch that's on here are at the sleeves and these sleeves actually go pretty long but again they scrunch up so they fit perfectly at my wrist i'm so in love with this y'all it comes in a variety of styles definitely recommend you pick this up you can wear this with heels you can wear these with tall black boots too if i wear this at some point soon while it's still chilly outside definitely about to pull up my thigh high boots because this is nice perfect for a brunch outing and over here you'll see it's two layers so you have this front layer here and you'll see this second layer is the short all right y'all it's time to get into this set i'm so excited to showcase this oh my gosh tell me this doesn't scream valentine's day this set is absolutely gorgeous i'm wearing a size extra large it is a two-piece set so it comes with a bodysuit that's stretchy and the pants also are stretchy it's satin but stretchy satin this is oh i love this but i also love this set so much that i bought this in pink and honestly y'all the pink one is my favorite <laughs> it just looks so damn good can you imagine rocking these with this popping heel what hello with a half up half down hairstyle oh my god i can see it now who's adding this one to the cart because she is hot i looked through a lot of clothes and items on amazon but i would have never found this i found this due to another youtuber she threw up a haul randomly for valentine's day and i saw this and I was like, I gotta get it. Look at the material up close. 
oh my god and it's so stretchy now mind you normally i don't wear an xl and body suits at all but when it comes to bottoms I, I have to go large or extra large so i wasn't about to get this in a medium i'll put it like that or else that probably would have been too tight for me but i am curious i might order this in a large just to see how it fits and maybe i can get back to y'all on that because honey ooh, look look at the sleeves you got the little slit detail oh my god this is a must have y'all do not sleep on this popping ass set now what i will say though the one con to this look at this the stitching here isn't the greatest like i feel like it's trying to unravel a little bit and this button is like hanging on for dear life. Y'all see that? I would definitely just take this button off and I would just buy a prettier button and just sew it back on. Easy peasy. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's time to get into some dresses. Super excited because I really love the items that I picked up. Now this first dress here is actually a dress I bought during the winter time, but I had to bring it back because I think, you know, this is the perfect red for Valentine's Day and I absolutely love the way it conforms to my curves. I originally saw this on Nia Danielle and I knew after seeing on her in the green, I had to have it in the red. I'm also wearing this push-up bra, which is amazing and a great at a great price point, y'all, like under $25. Go grab this bra if you're trying to make your girls sit up like mine. I know the highest bra size available is like 38 double D. So yeah, just keep that in mind. Y'all, I absolutely love this dress. Super, super stretchy. I have this in a size medium. And I recognize this brand, Tamwear. I've had a dress by them before a long time ago. It was good quality. When you click the link, the dress don't look like nothing because it's not on a body. But as you can see, it's giving body yaddy yaddy. Okay, y'all, this next satin dress, I am absolutely obsessed. Obsessed. <laughs> it looks so good on. I feel like this size large fits my curves perfectly. It's 100% polyester, so you're not gonna find like a lot of stretch with this dress. I actually put on this dress over my head because when I tried to do it with the zipper down, it was hard for me to zip up. But over my head, it went on just fine, and I love it. How do y'all feel about this? Let me know in the comments. And this dress is not just available in fuchsia. They have tons of colors on the website. So I'm telling you now, if you don't like this color, go click the link, sis, and find another color. Like, this is a dress that you have to have in your collection. Even just looking at the fabric of it, like, this is like a heavier satin material. The, the fabric is awesome. I, I was expecting it to be much thinner because I have another dress from Amazon that's satin and it does not feel quite like this. This actually does have some stretch in it, but it's not a whole lot, now that I'm thinking about it, but y'all stop playing with me stop playing with me go get this dress y'all oh my god i can't stress it enough i really hope it's available like for fast shipping in case you need something for valentine's day also this is why you need to follow me on instagram because i am starting to post my amazon finds through ig reels on there so that way you can get to know what's going on before I make my YouTube videos because I just showcase things first on IG. I'm also getting back on TikTok, y'all. Yes. TikTok to me is just overwhelming, but I'm getting back on there. So follow me on TikTok. I have to switch things up because it started getting dark yesterday. So this is day two of filming. Okay, this next dress here is a PU leather dress, a pleather dress, as they used to say. It's in a size large. Now, once I was able to get this thing on, I actually really love the way it looks on me, but I couldn't zip it up by myself. <laughs> I had to ask C to help me. I've heard of a trick you can do to like use a hanger to pull up your zipper in the back. I know it's just because I'm a little thicker in the midsection, so just keep that in mind. You might have a little trouble pulling it up depending if you are like my similar body type. But otherwise, I think the dress looks really great on. I like the fact that it has a slit in the back. So it makes it a little bit easier to walk when you have a slit in the back like that. Here is a close-up of the material. And you know when I first got this, you know, I was like, okay, this is definitely not like real leather. That's okay. I'm just going for the leather look. <laughs> I'm totally fine with that. This is what it looks like on the inside. They have this dress available in short styles and long styles. They have black, this cognac color. They have a creamy color, like an off-white color. Looks very cute. But here's the thing. When I purchased the short one in the large, it wasn't fitting right, y'all. I'm sending it back. I don't know if it's because of my booty or what, but uh, <laughs> I'm just better off sticking with this this long one here. Overall though, 
this dress is super cute. I will say I think it's made for like a smaller frame. So just keep that in mind. So if that's you and you struggle to find like smaller clothes, I think this dress will work for you. Okay, y'all, this next dress, uh, love it. I wore this dress um, on Instagram and y'all were really feeling it. Y'all definitely started buying it up. First of all, the fuchsia color just gets me every time. I think fuchsia is like gonna be my spring color. I didn't know that until like this month. It's really been giving me life. The one thing I love about this dress is just how flattering it will look on multiple body types. If you have a little tummy that you may not want to show, this dress will conceal that easily. It's like a loose fitting dress, but it's still sexy. It just makes me feel so good wearing this I also really like how it's like this leopard print up close and here look at the sleeves you have these three buttons right here that detail is cute I love wearing shirts that have this type of cuffing at the end I just think it's so fabulous overall I highly recommend this I have it in a size large and I love 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 the fit this is a must-have dress in my opinion lots of colors available I definitely plan on buying another color or two if I'm feeling froggy so yeah y'all should too okay we're back with the red and this dress is so flattering on first of all we love a good ruche around here because ruching just does what it needs to do especially on curvy bodies like mine and of course I love off the shoulder so anything that shows the shoulders it's gonna be the item for me now the one thing with this one I feel like the way it's cut off the shoulder it's like does it want to be on the shoulder or off? Like it doesn't feel all the way off, which can feel a little bit annoying while wearing it. Now mind you, I haven't worn this out yet, but I can just anticipate how I would feel out. This also has like fleece, like a thin layer of fleece on the inside. So I think this dress is definitely made to keep you warm during like the winter, fall months. Not so sure about summer but i can still rock this in the spring especially when it's cool outside all right y'all i'm gonna tell y'all right now add this dress to the cart this dress i've purchased two other times already <laughs> this is my third time getting it first it was a short version then i got the brown and the long version now this one in red honey this is a fall winter staple and i'm still gonna bring it with me into the springtime i don't care if you're looking for a more modest look but you still want to have a little sexiness about you. I think this is the perfect dress for that. I absolutely love the fact that it has that V cut out in the back. My goodness, it just looks amazing. This is a dress that will flatter so many different body types. Definitely click the link to see what sizes it goes up to. It's available in a slew of colors and multiple vendors sell this dress. So I will include multiple links in case, you know, certain things sell out because this is a dress that I want you to get. I've gotten this dress in both the medium and large. And I can do both sizes, but I think I prefer the medium because it still feels loose, but still a more conformed fit, if that makes sense. But I love this, y'all. It's stretchy. It's comfortable. Oh my goodness. It has the two slits on the side. If you don't get anything for the fall or winter months, you need to get a dress like this for sure. Here's just a close up of the sweater material. Oh, I love the quality of this, y'all. This has been one of my favorite fashion finds in the past year, hands down. So question, do y'all like bandage dresses? Because I do. I haven't had one in a long time though, like probably since, probably since I was like in my early 20s. So I decided to pick this one up. It's black, I just got it in a classic color because I wanted to make sure I show y'all other colors outside of red. This material is top notch. I see why it has a higher price point. The only thing is the sizing, right? I got the size large, but part of me feels like I should have gotten the medium. I sized it because I knew bandage is like really tight and form fitting, but I don't like the way the back looks. I feel like the back is gaping too much where it goes past my butt. I want that all to just be form fitting like, swoop, you know? So, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to send this one back and order a medium and a black and see how I feel about it. Hopefully my girls don't like spill over too much cause that's what I'm worried about too. Like sometimes these girls have a mind of their own and they, they just wanna be out. <laughs> Y'all think it's me, it's them. <laughs> but outside of the sizing y'all, I think this dress is absolutely amazing. Great stretch in it. This material feels awesome. You can tell it's high quality. I feel like I'm getting what I paid for. And it also has this non-slip section here. 
And you'll see here where the zipper is, there's a section for you to kind of just hook it so that way the zipper doesn't fall down. That's why this clasp is here. This is how the design looks up front and I just think it looks great. They have other versions on Amazon that have straps if you don't like strapless. I like a few of those just so that you can have some options. Y'all, this next dress is $18.99. What else needs to be said? <laughs> this is under $20 and I think it looks great. First of all, you know I like off the shoulder and it's super, super stretchy. So even though it goes up to an extra large, even if you are a 2X, I think you can still fit into this dress. Don't quote me on it. Just trust Amazon's return policy if it doesn't work out, but I think it can work. I'm wearing a size medium, and honestly, I feel like I could have gone down to a small. Now, the one con to this dress for me, because I'm 5'3", it's way too long on me. It's definitely dragging on me. So I could use the ruching to like hem it up just a little bit, but I think the better option would be to physically hem it. But if you are, you know, 5'7 and above and you're wearing heels, I think you'll be good to go on this dress. Plus, again, the price is under $20. The keyhole area is definitely a little bit basic. Like, I've seen a lot of keyholes that look like this. I kind of wish it was, like, maybe a little bit bedazzled in some type of way, but it's okay. And, of course, you see how stretchy it is, right? And all this ruching on the side, I mean... Y'all, this is gonna be very flattering on multiple body types, so I recommend it. Okay, we made it to the dresses. Now it's time to do a little bit of lingerie. Mind you, I am doing an entire lingerie haul, and I decided to put it out for $20 Tuesday, so please stay tuned for that, because most of the lingerie I've been finding has been for $20 and below. Some of them way under, like $15, $16, which was beyond me. I was really hyped about that. I was like, I gotta show them. I would definitely appreciate your support and love on that video because I am a little bit nervous about it, but I really want to do it, so I am. So first, I have to start with this four-piece lingerie set. I talked about it in my last haul, and I will talk about it again and again because it's that bomb. For $19.99, y'all, this is what it looks like on me. Amazing. I'm wearing the extra, extra large, but I think I mentioned in the other video that I definitely could have gotten like a large or extra large. It's super stretchy. I was sizing up out of fear, but there's nothing to be afraid of, y'all. It stretches. It feels great on. I think the mesh is very sexy. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine me in my robe and then I just, you know, pop out in that? What? <laughs> See, will be looking at me like, <laughs> she gonna try to front in the comments, but it's cool. <laughs> but no, seriously, I did have the courage to post this on Instagram and I received a lot of love from it and y'all were actually starting to purchase it. I was like, okay, I see y'all. So don't sleep on this set, y'all. It comes in numerous colors. I actually have it in three colors now. I recently just got the pink which I'm going to show you. This is what the pink looks like. I have it in a size extra large. What else needs to be said? <laughs> Go get it. Grab the lingerie, sis. Next piece of lingerie I have is by a very popular company on Amazon called Avid Love. They have so many cute styles, y'all, and I love how size inclusive they are. I've seen styles that go up to like 4X. This set is one of them. This is actually a plus size set. So it's red. This is what the bottom looks like. You see here, it has this bow in the front. It got a little crisscross in the back. It's actually a combination of lace and velvet. And you'll notice the same thing with the top two, lace and velvet. This is what it looks like on, and I feel absolutely great in it. I especially love the crisscross detail in the back. One thing I love about a size lingerie is that it just fits differently. I have this in a large, and I feel like it conforms to my body better than like a large in the smaller sizes. So just keep that in mind if you're my body shape. Don't be afraid to shop in the plus size section because sometimes it just fits better. Last piece of lingerie, y'all. I have this teal blue color, which is gorgeous. I have it in the size large. And I like the fit of the bodysuit. I think it looks great on me. However, I do wonder if I would have gotten the medium if it would have fit a little bit more snug in certain areas. Like I noticed some gaping and I didn't really like that. But overall, I like the fit and I think it looks great on. Plus the price point, I'm pretty sure this one was under $20 too, or right at $20. One thing I do like about this set is the wiring that it has right here. 
I like the way it fits to my cup size and I love the open back here. It's cute and I love anything lace. So I think this is a really good look. Yes, family, we made it through this haul, this clothing haul from Amazon for Valentine's Day or for a date night or any special occasion. Let me know what you think about the items that I chose. I'm really pleased with this haul. Please share with me your favorite item. If you watch my videos and you've never spoken to me before, please let this be the time that you chit chat in the comments. Cause it really means a lot to me. I love hearing your feedback. And if you're ready for that lingerie haul, I'm not really ready, but I will be. <laughs> if you're ready to see it, let me know that as well. And if you're new here, tap that subscribe button, sis. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Make sure you like this video and also follow my Amazon storefront so that way you're notified when I go live. We have such a good time when I showcase different items and just chit chat on Amazon Live. You don't want to miss out. I'm doing it at least bi-weekly for the first few months of the year. So please come out, come support either Friday or Sunday. I haven't decided yet, but that's why you need to follow me on Instagram. Pay attention to my YouTube community tab because this is how I can update y'all on the content that is coming. And if you want to see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank y'all so much for joining me, for rocking with me, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.